The ejection tower simulates the catapult phase of ejection, the initial kick that gets you out of the, out of the seat. Fire. We've done an upgrade here where we're firing the actual catapult off of the NASIS seat. So this NASIS is Naval Air Crew Common Ejection Seat. So this is the seat that's in the F-18 and a few other aircraft. So we're trying to prove that in a controlled environment we can use what is happening in the real world. The new capability is what is actually being utilized in the fleet and we're actually utilizing the fleet assets so there's no cheating the test. You basically have the same gun that's pushing you out whether you weigh 95 pounds or 250 pounds, so you are going to get a different, a different acceleration. So we need to see how that seat performs under both, both conditions. Three, two, one, fire. We use a fifth and a 95th. Those are our high percentiles. You know, if you're, something's going to happen, it's going to happen on your low end or your higher end. Usually everything in the middle is going to be good, so we use a fifth female and a 95th male, so that way we get good data on either end of the spectrum. We're not really testing the seat, but we're testing everything that goes on the seat, and we can do that in a very repeatable fashion. We can set everything up beforehand, and we can test, you know, we can see what the differences are that are related just to the individual item, whether it's a new helmet or a new restraint or whatever piece of crew gear you're putting on the aircraft. Technology, of course, is always changing, so we want to make sure that we're giving the air crew the latest and greatest technology lighter, faster, you know, better, and this way we test it because we don't want to create another environment as to which is going to injure the pilot. Everything that we're doing here is trying to prevent injury to the pilot during ejection, so we want to test all the systems out and, and make sure everything's going to work safely for them. We test because in the real world situation, all you have is to pull the handle and you're out. Every time I'm out here testing, I just think of one more person's life is going to save.